What's up, Sid? You know what I'm saying? What's going on? How you feeling? Good, man. What's good with y'all? That's good. That's what's up. So, tell me about yourself. Where you from exactly? From out here, Houston, Texas. Born and raised. Never been out of Texas. Never been, been out of Texas? Life. Whole life. So, when you say never been out of Texas, you never traveled out of Texas at all? Or you just never lived? Out? I've never been out of state. The closest out of state I've been is Lake Charles, but that's, yeah. that's down in yeah, yeah. Texas. <laughs> Do you plan on taking any trips soon? God living. <laughs> already, I'm already. Right now. So, um, how was your upbringing growing up? Was it rough or was you know two parent uh, household? Yeah, cool. Just uh, my people get along. I feel like it's complications in every relationship. Already, already. I'm good though. So, um, cause you you say you're from Houston, you never been out of state. So, what's your favorite part of Houston exactly? What attracts you? Uh, I like downtown. It feels yeah. like I'm out of state downtown. Oh, really? Yeah, <laughs> There's a lot yeah. of shit happening out there. That's why I'm trying to move, really. Yeah. yeah. I mean, like you say, it's, it's a lot of, um, it's, it's, I guess you could say more fast paced. It's a lot going yeah, on. Yeah, it is a lot down there. So, um, what made you actually start um, producing music? What, what got you into that? Uh, friends, really, it was because my sisters, uh, I was trying to make them do music, but it turned out I actually ended up being good with the beats and, you know, here I am today. But it was really because of uh, one of my partners, Ken Low Key. Uh, he gave me FL Studio and yeah. he was just like make beats on it. And, so you just went into the studio and start trying it out? Mm -hmm. I was at my house. This, this was a long, this was like six years ago. This was yeah. a long ass time ago. He just gave me the software and I downloaded it and started making beats and shit, man. Self talk? Yeah, everything, everything. So, so, ground up. So how long have you been producing? You said that was about six years ago. So that's when you very first started? Yeah, it's been February makes six years. Because I started back in February 2015. That's like when I first got it. And I got my first placement uh, Christmas 2017. So after I got that, that's when I really started trying to turn up with it. And yeah, start trying to take it, it serious. Way, yeah. So um, talk about your placement, exactly. Uh, I got a couple of them. It's, I mean, they big, but you know, I got you know, young boy, little TJ, Rod Wave, and Lee Chopper, uh, Young and Ace. Okay. All the boys, all the boys can use it. Yeah, you state. Nah, shit, it's really all through the internet and Instagram and email. Emailing's big. Uh, just touching base with people and you know, reaching out, networking. Yeah, establishing a real connection. Just, yeah. But I feel like it was more to work. Like you know, the talent was there, so you know, the opportunity was there. I just sent the work in, and it happened. So, uh, what software do you use exactly? FL Studio. I was on FL Twelve for the longest, but I just got on the FL Twenty. And that's the only software that you. Yeah, on FL Studio. If you ain't using that, you. <laughs> All right. Switch it up. So, um, <laughs> currently, are you producing at your house, or you have a studio that you're going to? I'm console? all at my house. I'm really finna move out right now. I'm finna uh, give me a little townhouse on the north side. But uh, yeah, it's been all from my house. I, I made enough. That it's time to move on now. All righty. <laughs> so, um, touching base back on these, um, the few artists that you did um, get placements with, have you uh, linked back with them since then, or you know, to get more music done? Oh. Uh, any of most them, of them, particular. like I don't even think they know me. Yeah, it's been through like some people I'm real cool with, other people it's just been through emails and them just fucking with my beats and my sound. But uh, it's it's mostly producers or like DJs or people linked in with the other people. I'm not too direct with I'm direct with some artists, but most artists like I don't we ain't, we don't even talk like at all. So yeah. Yeah. That's how it goes with a lot of people though, so shit, that's the game right now. More so just behind the scenes, you just yeah, been working. They, shit, they paying me, so that's all they <laughs> Already? Yeah. So what would you tell somebody that's wanting to get into producing and don't know where to start? That's a good question. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, it's crazy though, just doing it, you kind of got to want to do it. A lot of people I see make beats and... They do it, but they don't really want to do it. They they still go work their job and yeah, and, and that's what everything. Though, that's, you know, if you're gonna do something, you gotta really want to do it and take them risk and take the loss and put the dedication into it. Uh, you know, I didn't spend all my money to make you know get the laptop or 
get the speakers or get the piano and get the software, get the sounds. Like I spent all my money, you know, I lost plenty of jobs or, you know, the same old little bullshit everybody go through, but you gotta want it. Like, I yeah. feel like you gotta make it, like y'all making it happen right now. Already, right, yeah. yeah. You gotta eat.